man, boxing in 2024 starting to shape up, starting to really shape up. Now, Tiafimo Lopez is willing to fight Ryan Garcia. Tiafimo Lopez has called out for a fight this upcoming September or December. It's your boy, Mr. 926, a.k.a. Bushido the Dragon, a.k.a. Captain Karate, a.k.a. The Black Mage, a.k.a. I can just do this all day, the two-time Demontas champion of the world. Get the likes up! Check it out, man. We've been hearing some good news in boxing, right? And now Tiafimo Lopez is interested in fighting Ryan Garcia, man. Yeah. And, yeah, Michael Benson reports. Actually, it's from Punch Drunk Boxing, so salute to Punch Drunk Boxing. But he says here, Tiafimo Lopez has called for a potential fight versus Ryan Garcia in September or December. Then he says, quote, it doesn't necessarily have to be at my weight class. It could be at a catch weight, so we don't have to have any problems moving forward. Mm. Interesting, right? Very, very interesting indeed. That Tiafimo Lopez, I think he got a fight coming up, man. This is how good of a job top rank is doing and promoting their fighters. It wasn't just Terrence Crawford. Uh, I think Tiafimo got a fight coming up. I'm not sure. Hey, correct me in the comment section. I'm not even sure. Because last time we heard that he was trying to um, – Turkey Alashiki was looking to get Tiafimo Lopez on a Terrence Crawford card. Something about Tiafimo Lopez said he's worth more than $5 million or something like that. Now we're hearing that he's interested in facing Ryan Garcia. Um, yeah, that should be a great fight. You know what I'm saying? If, and if Ryan Garcia is going through all his young fellow rivals this soon, then let's let's make it happen. Um, I think it will happen. I think Ryan Garcia would fight Tiafimo Lopez. I think Ryan Garcia will probably fight all these guys that he's been calling out. I think Ryan Garcia is is crazy enough to fight a lot of these guys. With the uh, lawyer of top rank, you know, I spoke to a group of them, and I told them exactly how I wanted this to be planned out. You know, and um, we'll see what happens, man. We even said, like, hey, to Ryan and his team, you know, we could do something, like, in September, December, you know. And That's it doesn't necessarily have to be at that at my weight class. It could be a catch weight. So that way we don't have to have any problems moving forward. Hey. <laughs> hey, it sounds good to me. Two of boxing's most... Man, this, the build-up to this fight is going to be insane, bro. I mean, Devin's my guy, but he's not the most, right? Like, he's not like a guy that's going to be doing, you know, Tiafimo Lopez is that guy. Ryan Garcia is that guy. The build-up to this fight is going to be crazy. Everybody got psyched from what Ryan was doing, you know? And he played it smart. He did what he did. You know, he came out there and said what he was going to do and what he was going to handle, you know? So... You know, congratulations to him. That's all I can say. You know, and, and they got their own plans. So I'm just over here just waiting on terms of just like they're going to do what they do. And, um, yeah, man, we go from there. We see what's next. What was your prediction going inside that fight? Going into well, that fight? my prediction was that it was just all in the system. So it was just going to play out the way it was. Ain't what kind of answer was that? <laughs> It was all in the system. T. Fima Lopez thinks everything is orchestrated, apparently. He was supposed to win. You know? Yeah. And he was supposed to win. You know, system. So it was just going to play out the way it was. Haney was supposed to win. See? Haney was supposed to win. See, he... <laughs> oh, man. This dude, he really believes. <laughs> you know? Yeah. So I'm, I'm actually happy the way things turned out the way it did, you know? Had I, you know, so with Ryan now in the mix, I mean, it just makes things much better, you know, but that doesn't take away from what Haney has accomplished and what he's done in mm -hmm. his time frame, you know, and, you know, he just wanted to cash out, but he sure did. So, hey, um, I, I don't, I don't think Devin was looking to cash out, bro. You know what I'm saying? That, that wasn't, that wasn't a cash out move from Devin. Devin's been fighting, um, just all the names, all the names that he can get get in the ring. At one point, Devin Haney was considered the boogeyman. You remember that, you guys? That was that wasn't too long ago where Devin Haney was having a quite a hard time getting guys in the ring with him. For whatever reason, he couldn't get guys in the ring with him. Y'all remember that? That wasn't too long ago. I know y'all memory ain't that bad. I didn't pull out the the black the men in black pen 
to to erase you guys' memories. I just I didn't do that. So I don't know what he talking about, but whatever the case, man, go check out the rest of the interview on Punch Drunk Boxing. Um, Tifima Lopez, man, said he is interested in fighting Ryan Garcia. Um, he said that he's glad that the the way the Devin Haney Ryan Garcia fight played out, it played out the way it was supposed to play because it was in a system. And that David Haney was supposed to win. And he's glad that Ryan won. I actually find that pretty hilarious. But and it's anything that's Tiffany Lopez. But whatever the case, man, him and Ryan Garcia, it should be a really good fight, man. It should be a good fight if it was to happen. Ryan Garcia, um, he's been everywhere. You know, you see him here, you see him there, he's been everywhere. Uh, he's been with Trump, he's been with football players, uh, he's been boxing with this dude got some hands right here. This 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 football player. Um, Colorado. I don't know who, who, what team or who this kid is, but he 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 got some hands for Ryan Garcia apparently. Um, <laughs> yeah, that's where all our boxing talent is at, man. American talent is is doing other sports, man. But Ryan Garcia, Tifimo Lopez, I think that's a good fight. I think that's a fight that we could look forward to. Um, at this point, Ryan Garcia, I think he kind of has to take the fight just because um they are like rivals so to speak even though they don't have the same animosity that they had against Devin and tank and you know the other dudes but whatever the case man they looking to fight each other tfimo lopez says Devin haney was looking to cash out i think tfimo lopez is looking to cash out too tell me what you guys think like subscribe hot your boy peace out